Hello there, hi, it's Julie Rothel here from rtheaven.com. So I'm going to do a, another live demo um, with the encaustic stylus today. Um, you can see that little reservoir there, if I hold it at that angle, um, you can see that's where we're going to kind of suck the wax up, like a bit like a fountain pen. Um, and I'm just gonna add some em embellishments to this doodle I did a little miniature live um, sorry miniature hot plate demonstration earlier in the week where I showed you how to get these kind of colors and effects using the iron as a miniature hot plate so I can't actual finished painting at the moment um, just too many things all going on at the same time so I'm just gonna sit and doodling and we'll just add some colors and things to this so I would try this this way around. I'm hoping I can get a better camera angle for you. Let's see. Here we go. Okay. Hoping you can get that okay. I'm not going to chat too much, I'm just going to sit and play with some colours. But uh, I've got my lovely red colour again. Just going to get a nib full of wax and then start creating. So I'm getting really, really large dots at the moment and different colour waxes will melt quicker than others. You can see one quick dab of this. So the stylus is very hot and the wax is very hot. So if I wanted to get smaller dots, I'm just going to turn it off a minute just to let that cool down for a moment or two. Hopefully I'll get a little bit more control with the wax. If that doesn't work, I might need to do a minor adjustment with the, with the nib. But it was working fine the other day, so. So already you can see the dots are starting to come out smaller because it's not as piping hot as it was. You can also add the stylus, the wax from the stylus on top of an existing painting as well.
if you can see that okay so it's really therapeutic for highlighting things edging writing with and you can see the stylus is cooled and this wax is also um not run is as runny as this one. Um, and i'm getting a much better a much finer line with that so i'm going to do a bit more hopefully you can see this okay If not, go to my Facebook page, Julie Ann's Gallery, and you will see the photographs and the close-ups of um, all of the pictures from each day in the comments of that particular live video. I'm also just putting them into a video compilation as well, with the stills that you can actually see properly. So this is beginning to cool down a little bit too much now, so I'm just going to turn it back on again, just on to number one, to keep the wax flowing. Sorry, keep my tummy rumbling. Anyhow, there we go, you get the idea. So if you want to learn more about um, encaustic wax painting, which is literally just painting with hot wax, um, this is a very quick and accessible version that you can do easily from home. There is another version which um, you can build in layers. Um, but yeah, go to my website, artyheaven.com. There is lots more information on there. Um, including online courses, uh, free ones as well as paid ones. Um, I have a, a membership option, so if you if you prefer to learn week by week and literally kind of get um, or you know month by month and get instruction on how where you are and get feedback on where you are, then that's a really good option for you. So yeah, go to my website, take a look, and I'll do a little bit more to this and I'll post in the comments below this Facebook live video in a little while. Right, I think I better stop there for